Hi guys, this is Ranjit and as you can see we are outdoors and I purchased a new car which actually supports both Android Auto as well as Apple CarPlay and I have an Android smartphone. So we're going to test out how well actually Android Auto actually works in India. So let's uh, check it out. And you have to actually download this app that is known as Android Auto. It's a very small app and once you have done that, also in a car system, for some car systems you have to enable that option. Once you have done that, you have to connect uh, it, uh, uh, your smartphone via the USB cable. So I'm just going to do that. And once I do that, see what will happen. And uh, it's going to say uh, you have to select it. And now the option of Android Auto has uh, come on the screen. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to invoke this. And now what it has done is it has taken over the car system. Now everything uh, I can, this is the base Android Auto home screen. It shows you the recent what's happening. For example, the weather, last calls, what I've made. Again, this is a touch screen so I can see that. And you have quite a, a, a bit of paints. And the whole thing of Android Auto is that now if you have the, uh, your car has these buttons, you can control it via just this one. Uh, so entire thing of Android Auto is that you should concentrate on your driving instead of just fiddling around with the system. So uh, it has very good voice integration. Uh, so I'm going to show you that. But first, let's look at this. The first pane is navigation. And if you have used Google Maps, you'll be very familiar with this. You also have some options over here, recent places, what you have done, gone traffic and all those, those things are there. Second is calls. It actually shows you the recent calls that you have made. This is the home screen that you have, as I mentioned. And also you can play music. If you just press this music uh, pane, it's going to pick up the last track that you were playing and stuff. Uh, it's not just uh, right now it's pulling up from, from Google Play Music, but it also works with other providers. For example, Amazon Music, Ghana and some others. Not all apps are supported. For example, I miss the fact that uh, Wink is not supported. Uh, but that's what regarding the music and the last option is to go back to your car uh, manufacturer's interface that is uh, this is a hyundai car Verna, so it'll go back so i'll just hit home and now what uh, we'll do is uh, uh, obviously you can play the music for example if i play hit this it's going to play the music and you can control the music volume etc from a car interface i'm going to skip the track as you can see so you can do this you can control everything via this and uh, another thing is that you can also uh, make calls, do navigation, etc. with just your voice. I'm just going to show you that this is the voice button on this car. If you don't have that button on your car, you also have this voice icon over here. You can use that, but I'm just going to use this one because this car supports that. And let's say I want to navigate to some uh, location. I'm just going to do that. I'm going to press this. Navigate to Jubilee Hills. Navigating to Jubilee Hills. And as you can see, uh, I, so uh, the navigation now works. Uh, so this is going to work and this is typical Google Maps that you're getting. Uh, so very familiar interface and turn by turn directions also work with this. Uh, we can also actually make calls. So let's try doing that hands free. Again, I'm just going to press this button. Call Amit Bhavani. Calling Amit Bhavani mobile. So as you can see, I didn't touch anything and it's making a call to Amit Bhani. Let's see if... <laughs> he has some music. <laughs> oh, I hope he picks it up. I'm going to just mute the volume for a couple of seconds. Yeah, he picked up the call. Hey, Amit, can you hear uh, me? Yes, yes. Uh, so I'm actu actually making this call from the car using Android uh, Auto. Oh, that's nice. Not from your phone. Not uh, my phone is technically connected, but yeah, I don't have to fiddle around with the buttons. Actually, I'm trying to now drive a little bit, and I'm talking to you. And uh, I don't have to actually look at the interface. Everything I'm doing by a voice. And Amit, I've also heard that we can actually read uh, what do you say text messages and even send text messages via just voice. So can you do me a favor? Uh, let's end this call. Why don't you send me a text message and let me see if I can reply it by just using voice. Anyways, guys, uh, Amit, thanks. Uh, just send me the message. Talk to you later, man. Bye. So as you can see, uh, I've made a call. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm driving actually, as you can see right now, and I'm not distracted. I can do everything with voice. That's the beauty of Android Auto navigation. Everything works with just voice. Let's see if Amit sends a message and uh, if we are able to actually reply to that message with just voice. So I'm just taking a turn. And you can hit this button back 
for the navigation as you can see so when we are moving around the map act five minute congestion on national highway 65 in 800 meters as you can see you are still on the fastest route. i got a message from amit so let's just uh, read that i'm just going to park the car in for a second meters, turn left onto ntr mark so i'm just going to use that voice command and see if we can read that message so i'm um, just oops yeah read my last message i can't look up specific messages yet let me check on your new messages you have one message amit bilwani says hey ranjit what's up are you still driving call me when free do you want to reply yes what's the message uh, i'll be free about uh, after an hour and i'll give you a call buddy take care your text to Amit Bawani. I'll be free about the afternoon and I'll give you a call buddy. Take care. Do you want to send it or change it? Send it. Okay. Message sent. So as you saw, uh, I was able to send the message uh, and the interface actually read me the message. So all of this you can do with Android Auto. And now it's back to the navigation. And the turn-by-turn -turn navigation also works. So this is Android Auto and uh, it works actually really, really well even in India as you can see. Complete support for Google Maps. And we got a message from Amit. So as you saw, all, all of this stuff works. It's very simple as of now. Uh, the main aim of Google is not to complicate things. So navigation, your calls will work, music will work. Uh, not everything on your smartphone will work, but the basic things that you would require while driving works with Android Auto. Uh, so again, uh, this was a very quick uh, demo of Android Auto. And if you're purchasing a new car, uh, and uh, make sure it does support Android Auto. Uh, and if you're going for aftermarket, what do you say, DAS system, many of them also support Android Auto. So make sure uh, you have that option. So guys, uh, this was a very quick uh, look and demo of Android Auto. What do you think about Android Auto? And are you using the same? If you're using the same, would love to know your opinion about the same. So guys, uh, take care and uh, stay subscribed to my YouTube channel uh, and I hope to catch you very soon. Bye-bye for now.